We're at our first pit stop. Uh, me and Cole. Say hi, Cole. How's it going? You've seen him in videos before. And um, we're just uh, sledding around, stopping, taking pictures on the lakes. Uh, just through the helmet with live view, taking pictures of stuff. And uh, we're on an adventure today. Our last stop is going to be a big lookout. And uh, if we make it there, we should. And um, hopefully that's as, as beautiful as I'm hoping that it is. And along the way, I'm hoping to just have like maybe half a dozen keeper pictures that, that I could use. And today's probably like the best day for snowmobiling all year. Because it's, what, minus five? About that. Maybe. It's warm. The sun's out. And... Uh, it's a Sunday of a long weekend, so you can't beat that, and we're going to see the best of uh, northern Ontario here today. So, landscape is the focus, unless we see wildlife, but it'll probably run away from our sleds. And um, we're going to stop at the places where it's safe to stop and, and take you along for the ride. If you don't have a sled, this should still give you ideas for winter photography if you're having a hard time so so i'm just uh when it comes to what are we looking for we're looking for ice formations cool rock formations uh islands that look cool creeks beaver dams creeks beaver dams um anything that really stands out like that we're gonna try to stop if it's safe and and snap a quick shot and then hit the trail again so Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you at our next pit stop. It's just crazy to see it like that, though. The sun beams off the rocks and warms it up, eh? Yeah. That icicle is dripping too. Let me make a cool picture. It looks awesome like that. The colors even match. I don't know, but I want the sun shining through it like that. You see this type of stuff on Manitoulin, you know? It's so cool. I gotta get this one with the sand dunes in the background. I already wiped out once. Gotta watch where I step. The best way to shoot this, I love the trees going down the sand dunes and that group of trees there. If I can get the ice in the foreground, something like this, maybe. Maybe something like like this. Hard to say. Let's see what I get. That 
that must be Wolf Lake. That's a good parking spot. Oh well. <laughs> People are like ripping down here and stuff. That's crazy. That is unreal. I don't even know what lakes I'm looking at over there, but... Yeah, that must be Wolf Lake, because... Crazy. Huh. I pull out the uh, DSLR. It's a nice clear day, too, so... Try to take a landscape shot of this. Selfie. The phone won't do it justice. I don't even know if, if the Nikon will. Not there. It's still a picture. Yeah. Get, it's like. Get dumped on Facebook anyway. And oh, yeah. You know what Facebook does to pictures. Yeah. <laughs> Oh really? It's funny that you wear sunglasses under your helmet. Why? I just don't didn't think there was enough room. I know, I've been amazed too, but it's like perfect. I couldn't do it. Really? Kind of with the Some really nice sleds. Yeah, that's amazing what sled are these days, eh? I know, I like that old grand tour. I got the oldest one here. Yeah. 1990. 96. Oh, 95? Because you have the 35th anniversary edition. Yeah. And I have the 40th anniversary edition. Made in 94, released in 95. Oh, okay. My yeah, yeah. He told me it was a 96, but that's not accurate. Yeah. Because this was the first year that they changed the cap. What is your sticker? Oh, mine's January 2019. Okay. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> I just thought, oh shit, I haven't looked at that in a while. Yeah. So, lots of people stopping for the lookout. Uh, we're going to go straight to Rocky's restaurant, get a bite to eat. Probably won't record anything on the way back at all. Not much. We saw it. This is the main thing, and then those uh, pressure cracks are super cool. And it's all you can eat fish and chips, so we better boogie. Yeah. Our cars are still there. Well, we just ate. We had to wait a little bit. What do we had? We had to wait like 40 minutes, and then it took like. A good half an hour for food because it was packed, but Whatever. it's the weekend. Whatever. That is like amazing food though. And now we're gonna head home. I'm gonna edit pictures and this video, and Cole still has a long ride ahead. Another freaking hour and a half. Another hour and a half. To get to the the big city. That's okay. I enjoy it. Yeah. And uh, so we'll go out, and then we'll go our separate ways. And thanks for watching. The uh, lookout was pretty cool, and the the uh, what's it called? What are those called? The ice cracks, like the um, pressure cracks. The pressure cracks are super super cool, with the light shining through it. But anyways, thanks for watching. Hopefully, I gave you some ideas for you know, photos and whatnot, and if you have a sled, if not, then hopefully it still gives you some ideas, and thanks for watching. Bye.